Welcome to the Mechanic Desk help videos. In this video, we will be going over the quoting section. To access quotes, first log into Mechanic Desk and go to Jobs. From here, you will need to click the Quotes tab. This will bring up a new page with a list of quotes. From here, you will be able to see your current quotes, create new quotes, download an Excel summary of your quotes, and also search for quotes. First, we will go over how to create a new quote. To do so, click the New Quote button, or click on New in the top right corner of the page at any time. This will open up a new screen similar to the New Booking Job page. Enter in all the details you need and then click Continue. Note that under the Quote Details, you can change the type of quote this is. There are two options here, Quote and Estimate, and there is a setting where you can set the default type of your quote. On the next page, you can add items, headers, and job types similar to a job. Once all your items have been added, you can change this to a new booking, job, or even an invoice. You can also print, print part list, and email this quote from the following area. The copy feature will also copy what is on this current quote to a new quote. You can also add notes, photos and documents to these quotes. Here is a quote that was prepared earlier. From here we are going to move this over to a new job. Once we have clicked the Start Job button, you can see it has created a new job card, pulled the details of the quote and entered it into an invoice, which may be edited and added to if needed. Please note that when creating multiple invoices from a single quote, the newest invoice will only have the most recent changes to the quote. For example, if you create an invoice from a quote with line item A on it, then add line item B to the quote after creating that first invoice, the next invoice will only have line item B on it. Going back to the creation of a quote regarding the type, there is an option within Settings, Workshop Details, under Miscellaneous to change the default type. It will appear as the first option called Quote Title and should read quote as the default value. This can be changed to whatever you want your quote represented as. Now that concludes this video on quotes. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact our support team.